You mean I- wait a second, wait a second. We had seven grand with the furniture? Hello everyone, Brittany here and welcome back to part 211 of the Mail 100 Baby Challenge. Alright guys, where we left off, Pomegranate was helping a little bit with the babies, which you know we very much appreciate. Grapefruit got his grade in. We got a B plus, and uh, we only have one more class to go. And he has to give a presentation for this class. We got to start some homework, but I think it's time for a potty break and bedtime. Um, Yamachan again keeps visiting. I can't stand it. Uh, we opened as many presents as we could. The babies were crying like crazy. Um, but they did end up aging up, so they are down here right now. Actually, don't go to bed. You're going to have to... Where are you, kid? Oh. Uh, babble, 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 babble. And then you can stop. And grapefruit, if you would, please. Potty train quince. So, um, we are going to move. Don't you worry, I did not forget. I just want to grab a couple extra pieces of dough before we do so that we can take a few things with us. So, I don't want to leave too much. I want to take this. Um, we're going to leave everything behind aside from maybe... Um... I want to take... And potty chairs are... You broke the toilet, grapefruit. What the heck? Um, did she wake up and open one? Uh, I don't know. Um, all right, we'll keep working on that. Babble, 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 babble. There we go. And we're gonna need to grab out some food. So there was a Sims update. We now have likes and dislikes and an update to the bunk beds to make them a bit more functional and useful. Maybe I just said the same thing there. Anyways, so yeah, now our Sims can have likes and dislikes. So I'm sure we're gonna be getting pop-ups. Um, you can establish your likes and dislikes at any time, but I want to see what happens as we go through our game to see if they find anything they like or dislike. So I'm going to leave it at that. Although I just played my regular 100 baby challenge, my original one, and I was getting questions about some, if someone should like or dislike something and they were no longer my household. They were a member of the family, just not the household. So I was a little bit confused by that um probably a bug that needs to be worked out but it's still cool i like how this game is evolving i'm really enjoying it um i really hope it's going somewhere where um sims get a little bit more personality and uniqueness and i'm excited to see if that happens well i think one more babble will be good uh can you open another present yeah no it's never, no, not that recent. It's never, you can open as many presents as you want. Whatever. Oops, don't care about that. Uh, Alright, now let's potty train Prickly Pear. Just to extra make sure they are pottied and ready for bed. So that we don't have to worry about them going potty in the middle of the night. Uh, Prickly Pear will probably need something to eat soon. It is a nice calm Sunday, which is great. For me, it's actually Friday morning, and I know what you're thinking. You're like, Brittany, you're playing hooky right now. And I am not, actually. Um, we met our uh, goal, our financial goal, what are we going to call it, for the past two weeks. And we've been knocking it out of the park and busting our buns. And so because of the holiday, and because we surpassed our goal, they actually gave us the whole day off today instead of just a half a day, which is what I thought was going to happen. So, I mean, we have off Monday because it's Memorial Day, but I did not see them giving us the whole Friday off, guys. So I need to make use of this day. Um, my hubby's at work, so just me and my puppy. And it's kind of a miserable... It went from, like, 80s to 40s and rainy. So that's kind of crap. But, you know... What are you gonna do? Forget Illinois weather. 
Uh, alright. Well, yeah, I guess it's bedtime then. Perfect. Whoops, I'm hitting the calendar. Alright. Per Stop hitting the freaking calendar! Alright. It is bedtime. Go to sleep. Oh, wait, can you open a present? Stop! Open a present first. Open a present first. Must open present. <laughs> Cox crow table accent. Well, that sounds like no fun. What the heck is that? Some rooster? Yeah, exactly. Okay, that was a good chunk of money. That was a good chunk of money. Um, I believe these are now out of season. So, did I evolve these already? Oh, it's the back ones. Um, I don't know if they're going to... Bloom. Day one of summer. Summer and spring. Oh, yeah, they are. Yeah, they are, but it's cold, so I don't know if that's going to help me. Probably not. Probably not going to work in my favor. All right, let's speed it up. So let's, um, let's see what happens today. Maybe I'll just pack up a few things right now that I would like to take. Let's take a couple blocks and take a Dino. We're going to leave out the present pile. We'll take the toys. Uh, we'll take a couple potties. Take one of the beds. I'll take another one when they don't need it. I'm leaving the bees behind. They can torture somebody else. <laughs> um, let's also take this. And, I mean, I think these are cheap enough. I'm going to miss this computer, but we are going to leave it there because it is of high value. And I think we'll just leave. Oh, well, let's take this. Take this and this and this and that. Uh, maybe we'll just take one, two of those. And I think that's all we're going to take. Um, we're probably going to need a few extra pieces of dough because of what we took, so. Oh, well. Alright, can you go to sleep now? Thought you were tired. Go to sleep. Unless you're having a baby, which, no. we got to wait 14 hours, so like another day and a half until you have a baby. So, Monday night, Tuesday morning, roughly. If I am doing my math correctly, which is always up for debate. All right, let's breeze through this Sunday, get some more moolah, and not leave our homework on the floor. And we should hopefully be moving out really soon. guys I think that might have put us where we need to be um, and it is now summer um, I'm just going to take a few things like all of our plants all of our planters we're just gonna do it the easy way and put them in here like this 
Okay, I think that's the last thing I'm going to end up taking. I'll just buy you another new toddler bed. Ooh, let's grab our our toddler tablets, although we don't need them too much. Maybe just for that first skill of um, the first level of um, uh, logic, thinking, and then we're okay. So let's see what happens here. Let's go to manage worlds. And I just want to make sure we have extra dough because I don't want us to be short on money, you know. I just want us to have enough. Uh, 109. So I believe we need 102, so that would leave us with 7. I think we're okay. Alright, I gotta put the present pile in because I need to make sure we have that. That's been very vital for us and the mail, obviously. So I think it's, I think it's time to go, guys. I think we can do it. So let's let's do this thing. Oh, he's not gonna have a computer either. Uh, I guess that's okay. We'll we'll buy another one. That's all right. Okay. Present pile will be the last thing we need. And guys, let's say goodbye to our winter wonderland and say hello to paradise. Can you guess where we're going? Have you already guessed? I don't know. <laughs> so, I am excited because I did mention and you briefly saw that the house we're moving to is a house that I, it's from the Sims 3 uh, Sunlit Tides neighborhood. It is a beach house and it was only fitting for me to put it on another beach. Right? So that's where we're going! Guys, we're going to Sunny Sulani! Yes! And here it is! I did have to get rid of that cool shipwreck off the grid house uh, lot that was here. And I'm a little bummed about that because I haven't played with it yet. But guys, this is Sanctuary. It is a house that I remade from The Sims 3 into The Sims 4. We're gonna sell the furniture. What?! You mean I- wait a second, wait a second. We had seven grand with the furniture? And now we have 41 if we sell all the furniture. Are you kidding me? Oh, I feel dumb. Okay, hold on a second. We gotta go back. So yeah, this is our new home, guys! It's our new home! I love it. I built it. I never played with it. I believe I did a speed build on it. I believe I did. Uh, let's go back and we're going to take a couple computers because I didn't realize that I thought that was with the furniture. I'm dumb. Clearly we haven't moved out in quite some time and I don't know what's going on. So sorry. <laughs> I'm a dork right now. <sighs> Okay, let's just take a couple more things then. So I'm going to take this. And we're going to take one of our easels. Uh, we'll just take the bassinets. They're not going to be worth that much anyway. We'll take this. And we'll take, you know, we'll leave the beds. That's that's not a big deal. And then we'll just take this as well. And I think, um, yeah, we'll take this. And now I think we are really good. Okay, let's uh, let's do this again. Now that I know we have a lot of dough, guys, we're gonna have more money than we've ever had. I think. Yeah, I think so. Oh, this is so exciting, guys! A complete flip of environment. Or climate that we've had. I am so excited. I just wanted to be in a bright, green, beautiful place and this is what I'm feeling right now. This is what I'm feeling. So we're going to sell the furniture. We're gonna buy it furnished. I did tone it down a little bit so that this house would be as cheap as possible. Um, had I known that with our furniture we probably could have kept some stuff. But you know what? That's okay. <laughs> I went and modified this house so that we could freaking afford it, too. Alright, guys. It's our new island paradise. Ooh, okay. That is a cave we can explore. Okay, cool. Alright, guys. So, this is Sanctuary. It is from, like I said, the Sunlit Tides neighborhood. I love it. 
I built it. Well, it's not my idea, but it's... I built it. <laughs> Alright, so as you can see, it's very empty because I emptied it out. It was a bit... It wasn't too bad, but I had to tone it down for us to be able to afford it. And this is okay, because now we have some extra money. We can buy a few things. Um, I did cheapen down some things, like the showers and whatnot. Um, so, yeah, this is our new home. We have a lovely entryway, a beautiful blue kitchen, I guess, if you want to call it blue, blue cabinets. Like, that. that's my dream kitchen right there. I wouldn't mind having this. But the, oh, I would love that. I would, be, I would love it. Okay, so we got a nice... A living room with a full bathroom. We got our dining room, our family room, which I'm buying us a bigger TV. I was I was skimping on the TV here, but you know what, guys? We're going to buy ourselves a nice TV because we deserve it. So let's get ourselves... Uh, um, we need a... It's kind of weird because it's in front of the window, but it, it kind of works. But it kind of it's kind of weird. Um, yeah, that doesn't work at all. Um, what are we gonna do here? See, now I wish I hadn't got rid of the TV that was there. But alas. And that's already done. So let's get. Can I get something that matches? Can you put a TV on this? Or no? I don't remember. Um. Oh, that would work. If it allows me to do what I wanted to do, which is put a TV on it. It does! Oh, that's perfect! Okay. And then we need to buy some... Or put the bed... So here's what I'm thinking. Alright. So, yeah. That's our main floor. We have a beautiful pool. This was... Or in, in The Sims 3, this was actually a sauna. We don't really have that option in The Sims 4. So, I'm not sure what's going to happen there. We could put the toddlers out there. I don't know. Is that kind of cruel? I don't know. Um, beautiful pool. We have a little gazebo. We have a fire pit. This is supposed to be a garage, but I'm hard pressed to think we're going to get any cars in The Sims 4. Um, this is actually a little office area, which I now realize doesn't have a door to it. Oh, it does. Okay. I don't know why that wasn't showing up. Okay. So there's the office. And then upstairs, we got a nice bedroom here, a bathroom, another bathroom. A nice big bedroom, and actually, oh, I love all the sizes, the size of all the bathrooms. This is another living area, so we could put a TV in here, because there was one there. And this is going to be Grapefruit's little master retreat area, so, yeah, that's going to be just his little getaway. It's almost like a guest house kind of thing, separate from the house. There's beautiful balconies that surround the whole back side of the house. Actually, I think the bottom one, no, it doesn't go all the way around. But yeah, I love, I love this house. And I've not yet had a chance to play with it. I've used it in my Sims 3 game, obviously, just not here. And I just love it. So we're going to... Let's buy, um, ooh, yeah, I think I got a nice pretty bed for this room.
present pile, guys. We cannot neglect the present pile. We'll put it right here. So every day when we walk in, we can grab another present. Yes. Okay, so we could have put the towers in the garage. Is that cool? I don't know. I kind of feel like this should be the toddler room. Like, you know, like maybe we should just get rid of this wall here. Well, not like that. Darn it. Get rid of that. Okay, yeah. So maybe we'll actually have a normal dining room and we'll put the toddlers out here instead. We'll throw down some carpeting. And we'll just leave them in here, away from everyone else. <laughs> we can't hear them crying. No, no, whatever. Um, yeah, let's do that because that'd be nice then to, for us to have a dining room table, a little sense of normalcy there. We'll take this actually and we'll put it um, in here. I did have a stereo right there. Maybe I'll put it back. Um, I love the ice cream. We're doing the ice cream one. I love that one. Okay, guys. Well, this is our new home. I love it already. I am so excited. If you have any design ideas, let me know. I can't wait to get started here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please subscribe. Send me the world to me, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.